Angela. He's alive. Who is alive, Angela? Excalibur. What? That's impossible. Um, a filmmaker, a comic artist, uh, I would say an all-around creative. Um, I do editing as well too. Um, I do directing, I do casting. Um, I do some foley stuff and some, you know, song effect stuff and different things in terms of filmmaking. Um, I would say I have different hats <laughs> in terms of filmmaking. But I would say overall, a filmmaker. Um, I always was interested in um, you know how how they put together stories in, in terms of visually in terms of film you know so I was always intrigued as a, a, a boy um, even like doing comics and stuff like that because I started off actually doing comics now but I was intrigued like how they capture this and how they put this together um, so I basically you know went around people who had the experience and kind of learn from each each one you know to get into to get a full sense of being a filmmaker um busy ventures was a, a a dream it was um it was a put together work by not me my not me by myself um it was initially some other people um, when we came together and formed Vil Ventures, but Vil Ventures basically um, that Vil means love until now. So you know it, it was to show that where we're from and the representation and you know telling people that a lot of good things come out from these places, you know these stereotype places now. So that is basically how the Vil Ventures um, started. Early productions from Ville Ventures would be Techville. Um, we had like two seasons of Techville. The first one ran on Guile, second one ran on Synergy. After that, I uh, went on to produce All About Us, a soap opera web series. We did like four seasons of that. And then we had like a music show, interviews, and you know, we, we went different places, different countries doing different things, um, you know, with, with, with the brand, with Ville Ventures. When I think about superhero production, a superhero itself, you know, is, is that hero, is that, is that person that people can look up to, especially children. Um, so we have a long-term goal as to, you know, bring in everybody together, basically from different ethnic backgrounds within the Caribbean. Um, so what we start off with is a few of the production, a few characters that I have from since I was a boy and basically just to put them in place and create that universe because what we're doing is is a creation of a universe where you have these different characters um that could represent different cultures so that's one of the main things um that we're focusing on yeah definitely um and one one thing i see why I say that is that you know right now we do not school tour, we do not superhero school tour, and to be honest, it is it's really overwhelming. Where you could be going to these schools, we showing these kids like an episode or a short, and bringing all these characters for these children, and seeing how these children reacting and cheering them on and coming and taking pictures and embracing the characters now. So you know it, it was it was definitely letting us see that hey you know this could really reach as far as it could go now. Main thing, if you're a storyteller, no matter what genre um, of stories that you tell, don't be afraid to, you know, 
Don't be afraid to tell your stories, right? Because we have tons of stories to, to be told. So don't be afraid to tell those stories. Um, you can check out uh, GT Network. Um, so the Instagram is Network GT, Facebook is GT Network, uh, website is gtnetworktv.com, uh, Instagram is Network GT, Twitter is Network GT, and you could see all our um, sci fi superhero series. We have some other um, productions that come in, you'll see some coming soon stuff, and um, yeah.